Hi everyone, it's CJ here, otherwise known as Jersey Who 90. Yay! So, no block! We have no block! Yay! Um, the mailman delivered this yesterday. Tried to deliver it yesterday. But he happened to turn up at the same point my mum was picking up my brother. So I had to wait and collect it this morning before work so I know I've had this all day and it's been sat in my car and all the way at work during work I'm thinking no block no block no blocks waiting I have no block wanna open it <laughs> but yeah so I resisted I resisted the urge to walk back to the car park and pick it and get my no block that I'd slashed in my boot uh, and, uh, and open it <laughs> so yeah I resisted um, but yay so we have no block um, which I will open um, I'm at this angle again um, Still haven't edited the last video, that's why, so I don't know if it's improved or not. But we shall see. Um, I'm going to try this for the next, say, maybe this month I will try this angle and I'll see what I think of it. If I decide I don't like it, then it will go back to another, I'll think of another angle. But right now we shall see. Um, I'm still having the same issues with the, um, the about the whole blur thing like when I get close you see my hand blurs so it's difficult for me to show off the stuff I get in the boxes because the camera won't focus um, it just won't focus it will focus in one place I have to physically press the button on the camera in order to focus it to the thing I want to show you um, because the autofocus doesn't work on this camera it does work, but not for videos. When you go into a live mode, you can only record videos on live mode. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry. Sorry. And, um... Right. And as soon as you go on to live mode, it cancels out the autofocus. There's no fix for this. You can't fix this at all. Um... So basically it means I have to press the button every time I want to focus onto something. Am I in focus? Yes I am. It look, didn't look right and my glasses are... It's hot and my glasses are steaming up. <coughs> <coughs> this is why I'm coughing too because it's hot. Oh it's ridiculous. Oh. Oh. So sweaty. Unbelievable. It's raining, but it's hot. This is the British weather for you. It's ridiculous. It's like mentally hot, but it's raining outside. It's nice and cool outside because you can go outside, stand in the rain and go, ah. Oh. But everywhere else, it's ridiculously hot. It's horrible. Anyway, that's off the subject. Um, get to this now. 15 minutes. No, that's not good. I've been chatting for five minutes. Yeah, okay. So, let's get on with it. Woo! Uh, um, yeah, so that's the reason why. So, no block. Let's open and see. Oh, God, I didn't pick up scissors. Uh, uh, let's just rip the tape. With my fingers. Ow, this is painful. Uh. <laughs> I'm getting that. Oh, this this tape has got string in it. It's, God, no wonder it's tough tape. Right, almost at the end. Got it. Woo Crikey, and I've made a mess over the counter. A uh, table thing, table. But that is really good strong tape. I like that they use such strong tape. Oh look, I could have just ripped it off this entire time.
ripping the tape off is much easier. There. I don't know why I even bothered to rip that off. There was no point in it. I'd opened it already. Oh well. No block. Hello. Hello. I am a nerve block. Ha. Huh. Anyway. <laughs> that was random. I can't remember what the theme for this is, which is bad. Um, yeah. Uh, it'll be a surprise when I get that. <laughs> I can't remember. I'm terrible at remembering these themes. Um, apart from arcade... Oh, this one. Interesting sounding thing there. Plasticky. Interesting. I felt the t-shirt the side here, so let's get this out. Uh huh. Some dude with glasses. Is on this t-shirt. Uh, I love it. That's really cool. Who you gonna call? Oh yeah, that is awesome. Um. Ghostbusters t-shirt! Yeah! Awesome! Who you gonna call? Yeah! It's got each of their faces on there. Um, I thought there was only three Ghostbusters. I don't know, I haven't watched Ghostbusters in ages, I can't remember. Anyway, that's cool. That is awesome. Have you seen that? That is really cool. Look at that. That is amazing. Ooh, there's some stripes going on with my camera, that's weird. Who are you going to call? Can you see that? <laughs> yeah, you can see that. Slightly further out, there we go. Awesome t-shirt, I love that, that's really cool. So, awesome t-shirt to start off with, that's awesome. So, oh, there's that big thing. Ooh. I feel a handle on the big thing. It could be a lunchbox. Interesting. Right, let's go for some smaller stuff around the side. What's this? Oh, oh it's a stress ball. <laughs> that sounded like I was so uninterested in that, but no, it's cool. I like it. It's really cool. Um, I just thought it was what it was. I thought it was a Rubik's Cube. It's a Rubik's Cube stress ball. I thought it was a Rubik's Cube. Um, then I was like, oh, stress ball. Oh, okay. But yeah, I love it. That's really cool. <laughs> I just, I just really thought it was a Rubik's Cube. I didn't, yeah. I just thought, oh, Rubik's Cube, cool. But yeah, no, it's a stress ball Rubik's, cool, Rubik's Cube, which is also awesome. That's cool. What could this thing be? Oh, I know. It's summer mixtape. I remembered. Go brain. Yay. I remember, it is literally called Summer Mixtape, I think. Something about summer and mixtape. I'm sure it was, I don't think it was 80s mixtape. I think it was just summer, I don't think it was 80s summer. Um, mixtape, I think it was just a summer mixtape. But anyway, that's awesome, a Rubik's Cube. That's a stress ball, that is awesome. I don't know if I want to open it particularly. Yeah, I'm gonna have, I'm gonna damage it to open it. Yep. There's no way. Oh yeah, there is. Just slightly. It's gonna dent the package slightly. What am I doing? I don't know why I'm so fedentical about packaging sometimes. Well, got it out. That's awesome. Look at that. It's a Rubik's cube. Oh, it even has Rubik's cube written on it. It's a, so it's an official. Thing then. Oh, it's really nice and squishy. Oh, that's a satisfying stress ball. A lot of stress balls you get aren't squishy enough that you like, mm, and you can't squish it. Well, this one is really satisfying to squish. You see, look, it squishes and then it feels <laughs> that. Wow, you, that's the perfect stress ball. You want one that moves in your hair, that moves inwards, otherwise, it doesn't feel quite as satisfying, if that makes sense. So, yeah, awesome. I love that. That's really cool. I like. Oh, I 
keep going for that big thing again. Right, let's see. What is this? A coaster of kings. What is that? It's got a dragon on them. I don't know what these are. These are coasters. These are coasters. Um, it says, it's a Nurblock branded thing. It says, a coaster of kings. Um, this could be a Game of Thrones reference. This side's got a three headed dragon on it. Sort of. This side's got something. I'm not 100 sure what. Can you see that? Is that actually blurred or is that... Oh, it's actually quite good. Huh, maybe I've got a right angle this time. Um, yeah, I don't know what these are. I don't know if I want to open them or not. If it's something I'll be interested in, then maybe. But, again, I hate the... I had the... What was it that came last month with... With, um... Coasters that were, um... Cardboard. Here, we've got cardboard coasters again. I can't remember what was in the... What those cardboard coasters was in. Anyway, we shall see. Um... Um... It get like so I don't like the fact they're cardboard because they're cardboard I will never use them so I don't know what to do with them therefore I'm not going to open them because I don't know what I'm going to do with them um unless I know this unless I know it's something I'm into I'm not going to open them because I could use it as a trade item so <coughs> that's the reason but interesting, I guess. Right, what is this? It feels like a notebook. Oh. Right, now this is a thing that I didn't know anything about. So, yeah. Uh, 35 cards from the number one New York Times best-selling author. Authors. 35 cards. Now th this is the awkward family thing. Um, awkward family. I don't know. <coughs> oh, sorry. Horrible, this cough thing I've got. Um, awkward family. I've never heard of it. So I don't know where it's from. I don't know what um, this is. At all. Um, yeah. Oh, God. Number two pencil. Oh, God. That's a weird. Okay. Um, yes. Uh, let's have a look. So, from the number one New York Times best-selling Awkward Family Photo Series comes a collection of 35 classic and hilarious postcards to help you stay in touch with loved ones in the most uncomfortable way possible. My... Okay. So, it's a book, apparently. Um of awkward family photos. <laughs> Baby pee photo. I'm gonna pee on you, Mum. <laughs> well, you're trying to take this picture of me. I'm gonna pee on you. <laughs> I love that. I get so I sort of get I get the appeal of these. Um <laughs> Oh dear. This is a man smoking a cigarette um, it, behind his baby and giving his baby beer. Yes. That child's going to turn out well. Uh, <laughs> consult your doctor if you have experienced over-smile. <laughs> I like that. That's hilarious. I like these. These are funny. Uh... Vacation from hell. The best part of vacation is coming home. 
Uh, look at that. That just looks off. Like, a kid. Like, one's got a pillow over his head. The other guy, the other kid's making a weird smile in the, making a weird face in the background. The, um, whoever that is, whether that's the mum or the sister looks bored to heck and the dad or whoever that is is chilling in the background. That looks like really awkward. Uh, what's this? Dad took his role as head of the family seriously. <laughs> yes, that's embarrassing. He's obviously puts himself above everyone else. Now, this one is the next one that I found funny. Oh, I'm running out of memory, so I'll just show you this one quickly. Uh, not memory. Time camera th issues things, you know. This is the one I saw before, which I said was odd. Um, number two pencil only. <laughs> so, someone has drawn a picture of a baby on the pregnant lady's belly with the dad obviously behind. That's a bit weird. <laughs> but yeah, <laughs> there you go. Um, that seems to like a total waste of time. Obviously they did it just for the photo. So yeah, embarrassing. Here's staring at you, mom. Yeah, that's a bit creepy. <laughs> Boy in the middle. <laughs> Mother looking at her, then the sister looking down on him, and they both look like they're going to do something evil to him. <laughs> anyway, the last one. I need, there's, this, there's too many to show you them all, but they're awesome. She vowed never to change the channel. <laughs> yeah, that's the weirdest picture ever. Like, so she's in a wedding dress, and her supposed husband is on the TV in his wedding clothes. That's a bit weird. Anyway, that's enough from those. I like those. Those are hilarious. I don't know where they're from or what this book is that they're from. But yeah, this is funny. I take it these are just re I take it these are genuine families pictures and the sh book is about just awkward family photos in general. Oh dear. That's dodgy for a reason I don't want to say that one there. Dog instance look that's terrible terribly positioned dog there anyway that's awesome i like that that's funny don't know what it don't know what it really relates to but yeah right there's something really thin here no oh, papers papers oh that's the spoiler card and oh that's a spoiler card and a coming next month card so we'll forget that right now we'll just get over the Big, let's just get this big thing out of the way. What is this? It's a Ghostbusters item. Battle. Danger, high voltage. One KV electric shock hazard. Remove power. That's awesome! <gasps> that is so cool! It's like a lunchbox, I think. I think it's supposed to be a lunchbox. I will find out when I open it, probably. Um, but it's like... It's um, like the thing the Ghostbusters used to... Ghost... Spur, ghosts! That's amazingly cool. And it's designed exclusively for Nerblock. That's awesome. Um, Vapor Man. Keep me in a bottle. Uh, it's a thing... It's like shaped like the thing that you trap ghosts in. That's amazing. <laughs> Sorry. Forgot to, um, had to do a quick turn the camera off, turn it back on again. <laughs> because I forgot about the time. I said it just when I was looking at that. And then I continued to take stuff out of the box. What a noob am I? Anyway. So I think it's a lunchbox. Of sorts. Like, it's a really cool lunchbox. Look. It's got a thing. I think it's supposed to be a lunchbox anyway. That is awesome. It's designed like the ghosty suck em up machine thing they have. I can't remember what you call it. Um, it comes open like that. It comes up. Ah! <laughs> oh, 
That's really cool. <laughs> so it's shaped. Oh, no block. You're genius. You're really clever. I didn't expect that. I really didn't. I expected an empty lunchbox. But there's more. It's like a box in a box in a box. <laughs> well, no, too many boxes. It's a box in a box. There's something in here. Which is awesome. I tell you now, it's awesome. It's so clever. That was genius of them. I don't think the gross. I don't think what's in here. Um actually is part of this tin they've just put it in there to be clever which I love that's I believe I think it's probably going to be a separate uh, item on its own but yeah so the awesome lunchbox contains Slimer! <laughs> that is awesome! it's a Slimer plushie! Oh! there's nothing else in there but yeah how clever of them to do that, to put the Slimer plushie in here to make people think, oh, that's that. It. I bet a lot of people, I bet that's going to fool a lot of people. They're going to open it later on like, oh my God, there's an extra thing in my Roblox. <laughs> that's awesome. He's coming out of the bag. Like now, if I can get into the bag. Come on, I'm going to get into this. I am not. Well, there we go. That's all I needed. Oh, how awesome is that? Oh, he's even got a little tongue. Look. Oh, a little tongue. Ah. Slimer. Slimer. Slime. Slime. I love him. He's awesome. Look at those eyes. Meh. Meh. I love him. He's awesome. Actually, he is in focus there. That's awesome. Ha! Slimer coming at you! Ha! I love him! Oh, he's awesome! Oh my god! You could have just put this tin in the box and I... No, maybe not. I wouldn't have been happy with just a tin, but yeah. Oh my god! I'm just happy with this! That's amazing! Is it an official item or what? A ghost named Slimer. For the ghost who... Rather just be snacking. Slimer causes more than his fair share of mischief. Mischief that he does. Monsters everywhere plus Ghostbusters. Okay. I don't know if that's a special thing or what. He's adorable. Oh, I love him. He's really cool. Oh my god, that was a surprise and a half. I really didn't expect that. So, yeah, there's obviously nothing in the tin. I mean, oh, it's just a lunchbox. I only opened it to find out if there was some, if it was like, because the shape of it is odd. So I thought maybe there could be like a filing system or something in it. I don't know what I was thinking, but I was thinking there wouldn't be anything in it. It would just be a lunchbox. But I thought I'd open it just to check there was, if it was like a filofax or something like that, you know, or something similar, you know. Yeah, I don't know why I was thinking that. My brain is weird. But anyway, so awesome lunchbox, awesome Slimer. I love Slimer. I am happy with that. So next time, I am not too far from now in the September Nerblark. There will be other classic surprises in September as the theme is hyperspace. I knew that already. I saw an email. So it's just saying there's going to be, a, I think there's going to be a, um, oh yeah, that's right. There's going to be a, an official item from the new Star Wars Episode 7? Yeah, yeah, The Force Awakens in the September block and the theme for the September block is hyperspace, which I am excited for because that should be awesome. So yeah, now we've got the spoiler card, because I don't think there's anything else in there. No, there isn't. <laughs> so yeah, awesome. Ghost trap. That's, they just call it a ghost trap. Oh, okay. I thought there'd be some other posh word thing for that. So what we got in the box was the exclusive ghost trap lunchbox, which is awesome, and I love it. 
love that so much that is oh unbelievable ghost traps aren't just for the focused non-terminal repeating plasms phantoplasm sorry did you know you can also use it to carry your lunch <laughs> or whatever you like this is one trap you should stare directly into because it's got some good stuff inside <laughs> classic funny who are you gonna call this exclusive t-shirt is just for Nerblock subscribers yeah and it's a really awesome t-shirt I love it exclusive Slyra plush for all those with the courage to let this ghost out of his trap will find this delightfully cute and for all those with the courage to let this ghost out of his trap will find this delightfully cute and cuddly version of everyone's favourite green spud Slimer Awkward family photos Summer is a time for family and sending postcards and this booklet combines both of those things in the most awkward way possible nice Rubik's Cube Stress Cube Sometimes summer events can get you stressed Total bummer They're supposed to be this they're supposed to be the exact opposite if you feel stressed give this a squeeze i love it it's a squeezy stress ball that actually squeezes great i love these i love ones that actually squish that's really cool um king of coasters that's what i wanted to know nothing beats the heart the summer heat like a nice refreshing cold beverage and now you have your own set of coasters to protect your tables with it doesn't tell me what they are. How unuseful is that? Anyway, um, like I've said, um, because <laughs> because they are cardboard, I will never use them. So, if anyone knows what the reference is to that, I would love to know. But I will watch other people's videos to find out. Oh, what was? Where's the cock on there? Yeah, it was just summer mixtape, so it wasn't 80s themes, but it was very 80s anyway, which is awesome. Um, because you had the Rubik's Cube, which were an 80s thing. You had the Ghostbusters. I love that there was actually three Ghostbusters items in here. That's awesome. Was 80s. So it was very 80s themed, but I don't care because I love, I love the 80s. Oh, I don't know. I will look up other pieces of videos to find out what these coasters are. Um, I probably won't use them because of the fact that they're cardboard and they're going to get damaged. So, I won't use them. So, But still, uh, it's one of those. That's just my opinion, you know. Anyway, I'm happy with everything else. That's the only thing that I'm a bit like meh about, you know. Um, but yeah, so awesome... Ghostbusters lunchbox that's amazing I really love that I love Slimer plushie yes he will go with my plushies collection because he's awesome um, these postcards are really cool because they're really funny I don't know what I'll do with them but oh that's adorable that is cute it's a mummy and a daddy dressed as Winnie and Eeyore with the baby dressed as Tigger. That's cute. I actually like that. That would be something I would do just to embarrass the kids later on. That's brilliant. Oh, that's the P one. I'm back to those again. But yeah, awesome. <laughs> Sorry, I keep getting distracted by that. Um, stress ball was also awesome. And the awesome t-shirt. That is the slimer down there just hanging on to the bottom. But yeah, look, that's awesome. I love the t-shirt. So yeah, awesome haul. Awesome stuff. Awesome stuff. Awesome, awesome, awesome stuff. Um, I was hoping that I would get, even though it's Saturday today, I was hoping I would get some, some sort of, um, like, other parcel today. But I didn't, so. Just this one that I collected myself from the post office. But there you go. Um, 
the other thing, um, Collectible Geek is due any day. I hope it, I, uh, since it didn't turn up today, it should turn up Monday because I know it left London on the 20th and that was two days ago. So it should have arrived today, but since there's no mail today, sometimes they deliver parcels, sometimes they don't. I expect it Monday. If I don't get it Monday, I'll be like, no, why? The mailman hates me. And I'm still waiting for the junior block, uh, the junior boys. So that should be soon. That should be. Hopefully they'll all, uh, both arrive Monday. And my loot crate might arrive on Monday too. So hopefully. And then Marvel Collector's Corpse is on its way as well. So that should be good. And I should have in my geek box at some point. Hopefully. If I get missed out again. Oh. There. I'm leaving that. That's another. Uh, that's a video for another day. That my geek box stuff. So I'm going to leave it. Um. Anyway, awesome stuff. Awesome haul. I love it. Squishy, squishy, squishy ball. Squishy, squishy, shi. Cube. I love it. I really love this. I could play with this all day. Oh, did you see that jump kick? Whoa, with the elbow. That was clever. That, um, hit with the... Uh... <laughs> Aww. Yeah, on the table over there. I have to pick it up. Anyway... <laughs> That is the cue to leave, I think. Thank you for watching, people. Um, Apologise, this video has been a bit long and sporadic and talking about random things. Though it might not be by the time I edit this. I might have edited it all down and to just, like, very short. But anyway, um, bye from me and bye from Slimer. Mwah. See you later. Thank you for watching. Bye. Mwah.